back to my channel. My name is Shelby. If you are new here, I make special effects makeup videos, vlogs, fun stuff like that. And today I have a very exciting video because I am posting this on Halloween. Today is a jack-o'-lantern look and I tried this look out in the past as a practice run and I think I've perfected it to how I want it to really look so we're just gonna jump right in. So the first thing I'm gonna be doing is prepping my skin for all this makeup I'm going to be putting on it. So I'm going to be taking some Vaseline, covering all my hairs and going over the skin on my nose and cheeks because I'm going to be taping down my nose and you will see that in a few seconds. Okay, so I just put Vaseline on my face and that's because I'm going to be using masking tape to tape down my nose and I don't want it pulling at my skin and making it super hard to get off. So I just did a light layer of Vaseline to help with that. Okay, so I just taped down my nose and now I'm going to be making some triangles out of the masking tape over my eyes just because I want to make sure I get the right shape and I don't mess it up later on. Okay, so I have everything taped and ready to go, and now I'm going to be starting on the next part of this look. So I just have these strips of cotton balls that I soaked in liquid latex, or soaked is a strong word for it. I did a layer of liquid latex on top of several rolled out cotton balls, and now I have these little tiny strips of cotton balls, and I'm going to be putting them all over my face. And I did it this way because when I practiced this look, I did this part and then I just kind of put toilet paper and liquid latex over it and I didn't really get the dimension I wanted and I'm hoping with these, because they're kind of shaped really nicely to be like the ridges of a pumpkin, that I really get that look I'm going for. So I'm just going to be taking my liquid latex and pouring out a little bit into the top and applying these. Okay, well that looks terrifying. Well that looks really freaking cool. <laughs> okay, so I have everything on my face and I just need to let it dry a little bit. And then I'm going to be taking some cream paints along with a few others and I'm going to be going in and coloring myself to be a pumpkin. But before I go in with the cream paints, I need to go into the eye holes and mouth hole and just black out everything in there. So I'm going to do that really quick with some eyeshadow. grabbing my wet and wild paint palette and I'm going to be getting the orange
my nose is runny a little bit and so that's not a great feeling when I'm in this situation right now. One eternity later. Okay, so I have the orange all on my face. Face? Face. So I just mixed together a brown and orange color and I'm gonna be putting that in the creases to create some dimension. Okay, so I'm gonna go pop in some red contacts and grab some pumpkin guts and fake blood and I'll be right back. <laughs> 